Alright, all right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here on the show to talk about uh, some more NFL news right quick. It's probably going to be a quick NFL news episode, probably like a 15 minute or so, because I'm going to watch a high school football game tonight. So I want to get a quick, another quick uh, NFL news here, because I'm probably going to leave at like 6.30 when I'm recording this at 6.18. I just want to get a quick video out the NFL. Uh, Kentucky and Georgia preview will be later tonight, probably when I get home. Uh, from the games, uh, from the uh, game we're going to do tonight. We'll turn around to you, so a few quick topics that I want to talk about. Um, so there's rumors um, that there is speculation about the hashtag corner from the outside. Uh, is that they are likely to move on from a former first round pick, first overall pick QB Kyler Murray after this season, per Dan Grisanio. Um, this really doesn't surprise me um, that they there's outside speculation that they can move on. I don't know if I would. If the Cardinals are moving on from Kyler Murray after this season, it's because they want Caleb Williams now to be their long-term quarterback. But with the way they're playing this season so far right now, they might not get the first pick. Uh, but should Josh Jones be their long-term QB if that does happen? He's played above expectations so far. He's yet to throw an interception. But Grisonio wrote, The outside speculation, that the word I get when talking to agents and executives from other teams, is that the Cardinals likely will move on after this season. Again, that's speculation. So there's speculation that they can move on. Um, not shocking how his rookie deal is going so far. I don't know. I think... I think this is actually um, bait because basically what Dan said as a... Um, this dude was basically stealing and mis misinterpreting what he wrote for purpose. But um, he clearly wrote that the speculation was entirely external, not, quote, around the Cardinals. It was ex ex entirely external, so. Yeah, once again, Dolph Kleeman just using it for engagement and stuff on his tweets. Still misinterpret stuff. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they moved on from Kyler Murray. And he probably deleted the tweet, I think he just did, which is kind of funny. Free agent QB Cam Newton says the hashtag Jets will pay him more than $5.5 million, $5 million to sign him. You're not about to sit up there and penny pinch me, bro. I'm not about to sit up here and sign a $5.5 million deal, bro. Those days are over. I'd be wasting my time. Cam Newton was asked by RG, at RG3 if he'll sign with the Jets amid the Aaron Rodgers injury. And uh, he basically had a lot to say. Nobody will sign him anyways. I mean, he thinks he's him. But yeah, once again, um, with the Kyler Murray speculation, that's kind of just ex entirely external. It's not around the Cardinals. So, yeah. There's that. So, Steelers starting cornerback. Uh, calls Ravens rookie wide receiver Zay Flowers a, quote, little munchkin. Pittsburgh and Baltimore face, it, face it off each other in week five. Full quote, he's very shifty, very, very fast. He can get behind the defense. He's kind of like the guy that can do it all for him. Run the screen, run the reverse, and still also run the big post as well. So it's going to be fun trying to keep her on that fast little munchkin there. He's about to get kicked. He's about to get uh, cooked up. I mean, quote isn't even all that bad. It's kind of taken out of proportion. But yeah, he just needs to stop talking, to be honest. He's going to get cooked in this game. Cowboys linebacker Michael Parsons says some media members are bullies towards players such as Jets, Zach Wilson, and Giants Daniel Jones. They previously said about Ronnie Harrison calling Zach Wilson garbage. To me, that's fraudulent. Move Zach Wilson special in his own way. Now he says, I just felt like there's so many times the media just throws out negative things on certain players. It's almost like bullying online. We're just social media bullies. Hey, you know, one thing about Parsons, he, does, he sure does look out for other people in the league, not just, you know, his own team. He's entitled to his opinion. I, mean, I don't think Daniel Jones is good as Zach Wilson, but some people say about him. Yeah, it's, sometimes it gets a little too far. And the Raiders QB Jimmy, Gar Jimmy Garoppolo is clear the concussion protocol and will start week five against the hashtag Packers. So Jimmy G is back. So there's a quick um, little NFL video. Um, I'll do the Georgia-Kentucky preview uh, tonight when I get home. And, my, and then probably NBA news, just get NBA news, and then do it wrestling news, because there's lots, some stuff in wrestling you want to get to, so, yeah, until next time, I like, peace.